Hi boys and girls, welcome to another lesson of We Love Words. Can you remember our book this week? It is Tabby McTat. So, let's see what our new word is today. Follow along with me. The sun went down and the sky grew black. The stars came out, but he didn't come back. McTat lingered on and on. Can you point to that word? The red one, what does that word say? I'm going to read it again and listen carefully when I say that word, when I get to that point of the sentence. The sun went down and the sky grew black. The stars came out, but he didn't come back. McTat lingered on and on. And the word is lingered. Lingered. Can you say that word lingered? Let's say it four times. Lingered. Lingered, lingered, lingered. Let's say it to the ceiling. Lingered. Let's say it to the carpet. Lingered. Let's say it to the door. Lingered. Lingered. How many letters has it got? Let's count the letters. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight letters in that word. L -i -ng. Erd, lingered. So, lingered. Let's see what it means. If you linger somewhere, you stay there longer than you need to. So, these people are having a little chat in the car park and they don't need to stay there, but they are lingering around. They are lingering around the car park, having a chat, and they are staying there longer than they, they need to. Okay? So, if you linger somewhere, you stay there longer than you need to so remember that pause the video tell the person in the room what does the word linger mean so here's our anchor sentence then we've got the bold black word that we are going to change and our new word lingered in red so the family lingered at the beach the family lingered at the beach can you point to those words as i say it find the well done. The family lingered at the beach. Why do you think they are lingering at the beach? So they're staying there longer than they need to. Maybe they don't want to go home. They're having such a fun time. They don't want to go home. So they're staying at the beach longer than they need to. And if you see, everybody else has gone. So they are lingering. The family lingered at the beach. Your turn. My turn. The family lingered at the beach. Your turn. Fantastic. Right. So where else could the family linger? Where are this family? They are at the fair. So the family lingered at the fair. The family lingered at the fair. Can you say that? The family lingered at the fair. Your turn. Super. So the family have lingered at the beach. They have lingered at the fair. Where else have they lingered? Ooh, at the park. The family lingered at the park. The family lingered at the park. Your turn. And sometimes on our parks, we have like a seesaw, a swing, a slide, and it looks like a proper playground. But sometimes, most places, if it says it's a park, sometimes it's just a field. It's where, somewhere, it's where children and people can play. Okay, so the family lingered at the park. Your turn. Well done, sir. So, Oh, where are this family? Where are they? Where do you think they are? What can you see? Yeah, we can see lots of books. Absolutely, they could be in a library or they could be in a bookshop. Okay, so it's up to you whether you want to use the word bookshop or use the word library. Let's use both. The family lingered at the bookshop. Your turn. Well done. The family lingered at the bookshop. 
well done and we'll change the word to library because a library is somewhere where there's lots of books and you can go and get them and you can rent them out, you can take them out and you can bring them back and you don't have to pay. So the family lingered at the library. Your turn. Well done. The family lingered at the library. So they lingered at the beach, they lingered at the fair, they lingered at the park and they lingered at the library. Where else do you think a family or anyone could linger? Pause this video and have a little chat. Right, here's another example. The cat lingered down the street looking for some food. The cat lingered down the street looking for some food. So the cat stayed down that street longer than it needed to because it was trying to find some food, okay? The cat lingered down the street looking for some food. I would like you to practice saying that sentence, pointing to every word as you read it. Pause the video if you need some more time. Let's move on. Back to the story then. Let's read it in the context of the story. The sun went down and the sky grew black. The stars came out, but he didn't come back. Who do you think didn't come back? Who was McTat with yesterday? Fred, well done, the old man Fred, that's his owner. So he can't find Fred. So the sun went down and the sky grew black. The stars came out, but he didn't come back. And then it says McTat lingered on and on. So McTat is the cat and they're lingering on and on. Why do you think McTat lingered on and on? Have a think. Why did he stay there longer than he needed to? Well done, because he's lost his owner. So he wouldn't usually be there at night time, wandering around the streets, but he's stayed there longer than he's needed to. He has lingered because he can't find him and he doesn't want to go home without him. So he's wandering up and down and he's staying there longer than he needs to in hope that he finds his owner. Okay. Another example, the children lingered in the school hall because they didn't want to leave PE. And this made me think about when we do PE because we love PE and it goes so fast. And when we finish our PE lesson and I say, come on, boys and girls, let's do a cool down. We need to go back to the classroom. Everybody is a little bit sad because they love PE and everybody tries to linger. So when you go and get your sand shoes to put your sand shoes back on, you might go really slowly and stay in the hall longer than we need to. So sometimes the children linger in the school hall because they don't want to leave PE, okay? So the children lingered in the school hall because they didn't want to leave PE. Your turn then. Have a look. What does lingered mean? Okay. Tell the person in the room, what does lingered mean? Pause the video if you need more time but it means staying somewhere longer than you need to. So which one of these pictures shows lingering? The one on the left with the people on the beach or the one on the right with the beach that is empty? Well done, it's the one with the family at the beach and they are lingering because they're staying there longer than they need to. This one, it's empty. There isn't anyone lingering there. There isn't anybody there to stay there longer. Okay, so lingering is the one on the left. That family are lingering and that one is empty. So there is no one lingering around there. Okay, so lingering, lingered, this means the same thing. It's just whether they're doing it at the minute or whether it's the past. But you'll learn more about that in the year two. Okay, so which one shows lingered? The one on the left with the family. Well done for joining in boys and girls. You can write this word in your book if you want to and draw a picture, but there is no requirement to do that today. Well done for joining in and I will see you tomorrow.